Hey, what's going on there, folks? Welcome back here to a Sunday Earthmaster here, about 1.12 p.m. That's California time. Checking in here on this Sunday with a large earthquake around the Fiji Islands area. 6.5 earthquake coming in right now to that region. Rather large quake. Uh, on the Earthquake 3D globe there, looks like there may be two earthquakes being reported. We'll have to wait and see what the uh, revision is on this magnitude. Uh, 6.5 shows that it has been reviewed here by a seismologist. Uh, 174 kilometers deep, so quite deep into that area of the, uh, this is going to be the Tonga Trench up here. Across this region, quite a bit, two of them showing up. Uh, within about, well, we'll have to see here, but if this is two legit quakes or maybe a, uh, duplicate quake, either way, there's 17 seconds here of, uh, different. So these may actually be two different quakes, but of same magnitudes and same, uh, depth there into that subduction zone, which is 108 miles deep there. Uh, probably not going to see any, uh, tsunami associated with that, but we'll double check, make sure. No tsunami warning, advisory watch, or threat is in effect from the 6.5 earthquake that struck the uh, Fiji Islands area, south of the Fiji Islands area, into the Tonga Trench just a few minutes ago. The seismic waves are now starting to show up there across Solomon Islands. Um, really not see anything else showing up here. I don't really have anything specifically around the Fiji Islands area, but... Uh, Either way, that's a large quake. Quite a bit of a noticeable uptick here today around the globe in terms of plate movement. Keep an eye on these areas. I've been showing some, uh, you know, elevated uh, seismic activity, such as Southern California being a hot spot down here across the area of the San Andreas Fault. Keep an eye on that. When things start to move out here along the plate boundary, like we've seen all over here in the last 24 hours, now the latest is 6.5. It's good to be on guard. It's a decent sized earthquake. Uh, let's see here. Still showing up as two earthquakes. So rather, uh, let me check out the first one here. Reviewed. That's just on. And the second one uh, is underneath, I'm sure, review status as well. So it's possible we may have seen two earthquakes. Let me check the EMSC model real quick. See what we have. Uh, these guys showing... Well, I want to make sure I get underneath it. These guys are only showing a 6.3. So USGS, surprisingly, higher in magnitude than the uh, EMSC model. And, of course, that's, what show, that's what's showing up there on the EMSC model and then the USGS as a uh, 6.5. So, um, yeah, it could take them a little bit before they revise this. But either way, decent size earthquake. I'll provide more later on in tonight's update video regarding the elevated earthquake activity happening out here around the planet. Quite a bit all over, folks. There's just a lot of movement going on here. And when things are mo in movement, we got to be prepared for some larger activity. The Crow Cam Chat Trench had that super deep earthquake this morning. 5.9, 237 miles there into that subduction zone. That's another major area that uh, I feel is ready to pop in terms of a mega quake. All right, um, have a good one. I was just outside getting some yard work done. Heard my earthquake app go off. Still showing two earthquakes, so we'll check back on that a little bit later on this evening, see if those are indeed uh, two legit ones or not. Just kind of odd to see two like that, similar magnitudes, exact same magnitude, exact same depth. And, uh, yeah, but it's 17 second difference. We'll see you guys back here a little bit later on this evening, folks, for the uh, complete update.